All my classmates in the diploma program, they are pursuing uh, Canadian CPA, but then I'll be sitting in the classroom like, as if I'm having some superpowers because I'm already a CPA and no one knows about it. It's like a person having superpowers. CPAs are superheroes. Accountants do save the world. So I couldn't agree more. On today's episode, we meet our Miles Global icon, Siddharth, who is in a beautiful province of British Columbia in Canada. What does it take to become a CPA in Canada? And how can you do it? Keep watching. Thank you so much for joining us, Siddharth. So, was CPA always the plan? Before, before CPA, you don't, you don't, you won't believe how many courses I have touched upon. I have taken up, <laughs> I have taken up CS, CS, CFA, uh, and so <laughs> my dad always uh, supports me in whatever course. Uh, I take up. He, he never asked me any questions. Once I took up CPA course, and I understood that uh, the seriousness levels that were involved, it really helped me a lot. You have cutthroat uh, competition in the uh, job market right now, and uh, once you are a CPA, you can you'll really uh, have that confidence in in you uh, to face the interviews, and it'll it'll make you all ready for the your future ahead. Supportive parents are everything, and uh, you know how did they react when you moved to Canada all by yourself? They are, they are pretty open to it. They always wanted me to go out and uh, try it, new, new things, being out of home and being 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 out of your uh, bubble, getting out of your comfort zone. They always wanted to me to have that experience. Tell us uh, more about the diploma and how does that help uh, in the path now? I was just looking up for some accounting courses right in Canada so that I get my PR points and also the uh, points for my credits. Being a CPA, doing masters is also you are you are overqualified to be uh, doing a masters because employers here don't care about masters once you already have a CPA. All they care about is that you are a CPA. Having UBC on your resume is another plus point. In December 2022, I'll be completing my course and I'll get a minimum of two years of uh, postgraduate work permit. So I get the two years of postgraduate work permit. You just have to work for one year. You'll definitely get a PR. I'd suggest just complete the US CPA exams outside Canada and then get into Canada because so in the memorandum of understanding so if you are if you are a US CPA you'll directly be a Canadian CPA but if you come get into Canada and then do your US CPA here uh, you won't be able to become a Canadian CPA through that MOU so Siddharth you are in beautiful Canada what else are you looking forward to right now I'm I, I'm a little ambitious all I see is uh, earning dollars but then other than that i'm planning to join the ultimate frisbee team i was playing the frisbee sport back in christ university i was in the team uh... wait wait ultimate what frisbee is a sport now It's a professional sport. I mean, they're planning to get it into uh, the Olympics as an exhibition uh, sport. Uh, I think the next Olympics. It's a mix of rugby and then uh, basketball. Sport is, it's all about sport spirit. You don't have a referee. So even if you have some uh, clash during the game, it's the teammates from the opposite teams that come together and uh, they decide upon it. So uh, that's one unique point in the sport. Incredible. This sounds like so much fun. It's the fall season in British Columbia. Uh, it must be really beautiful now. The view from the apartment is really good. I can show it to you right now. The view is really good. Oh, we would love to see the view. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. I'm staying in Burnaby right now. So it's uh, it's, four, it's 11 kilometers away from my campus. People say that's the most beautiful place here in uh, British Columbia. It's, at least it's, it's, it's a magical place. Looking up to my colleagues who were doing this CPA program, and I was taking tips from them. I was researching more, and then I thought, okay, Miles, Miles would be a better option for me. Down the line, I always, uh, I always had this in mind. Whatever course, course where you're, you're taking, it's all up to you. Uh, uh, what kind of efforts you're putting in? But taking up Miles have definitely helped me up, uh, help, help me smoothen the process. Now that you're there working and studying, what has kept you going in this journey, and what advice do you give to our audience? I, I haven't stopped myself at one point. I, I kept trying on new things and uh, I always wanted to go up higher on the ladder and I was always looking for uh, quick ways to do that. There's one way to do uh, smarter work and always finding smart ways where you can quickly move up the ladder. So I thought, yeah, don't uh, not to stop myself at any, any point and always give it a try. See, that's the attitude that makes a global icon. Miles can help you achieve your global ambition. Visit our website and I will see you in the next episode with the Miles icon from another part of the world. Oh.